I'm Roger Bowers. Welcome to Law Enforcement Employee Science. We offer a program here at Herndon Career Center for juniors and seniors that are interested in law enforcement or many of the fields related. For example, crime scene. Uh, we have students that want to go into deal dealing with criminal minds subjects. Uh, we also deal with crime scene investigations and we offer a one-year program, but we do allow second-year students to come back and work on more advanced projects. What our program is for is any student that is going into their junior year or senior year that is, has any interest at all in law enforcement. We know you see law enforcement on TV, you see a lot of TV shows about it. Our program is for the student that wants to come in that's maybe interested because they've watched CSI, so we can show them what CSI really is when you're working out in the field. We can show you what police works when you're, when you're really working in the field. What you're seeing in this area is our firearm simulation room. This year our big focus is on de-escalation. Students can now make the choice to work with an officer and try to talk them out of when they're using too much force. Uh, the police science portion of the class is usually done second semester. Uh, police science, one of the favorite projects we do is we'll put fingerprints on various uh, types of surfaces and the students are trained how to lift fingerprints. We have a new microscope we use this year that we can take pictures of the fingerprints. Uh, we do comparisons with fingerprints. But also, we also talk about how to uh, collect DNA samples, blood samples. We talk about if uh, somebody's shot, how you can look at blood splatter and measure it and determine what uh, maybe the angle the shot came from. Uh, we'll, we get into some plaster casting, just various things like that. Also on campus, we have a squad car. We use this police car for uh, car stop scenarios. Uh, anytime we want to simulate that they're pulling up on a call and getting out of a car. Uh, just a couple weeks ago, we did car stops where they were simulated pulling behind a vehicle. They get out of the car, they use radio traffic, they walk up to the car, and when they finish the call, they get back into the police car. We have a really exciting class here where we focus on all things police. So if you're interested in being a police officer, we'll teach you all about that. If you're interested in crime scene, that's also another area that we'll focus on. We also spend a lot of time working with the role of a dispatcher and the role of a detention officer. So anything that you can think of that's related to law enforcement, this is what this class is an introduction for. Here in our program, we spend a lot of time doing hands-on drills. So Mr. Bowers will spend a lot of time with crime scene processing. One thing that I like to spend time on is handcuffing. So it's really important that we bring those practical skills to all the students in the class because the hope is if they do go into the field of law enforcement, they have a really good base and they're already doing things the right way. We're so excited this year in our law enforcement police science program that we are able to offer internships for our second year students. These students have the opportunity to join local police departments out in the field and they can observe detention officers as they're doing their daily job. They can sit with our communications officers and listen to 911 calls as they come in and hear what those dispatchers say. They can also sit with the property and evidence officers and see what it takes to take in evidence and keep it secure. And then they can also sit with their front desk personnel and watch as they take reports and hear what the citizens have to say. In the past few years, we have had a handful of students who have gone into the law enforcement field. We have students who have become police officers, uh, dispatchers, and detention officers. And they have expressed to us that the things that they learned here at Herndon have really helped them in their current field. 